Welcome back to Lake Dardanelle. This is day one of the Cabela's Collegiate Bass Fishing Series. We'll pick up the action with the University of North Alabama's Nathan Martin and Parker Davis. We just need an old big bite early like we had yesterday. Huh? So we just need an old big bite in here early like we had yesterday. We don't get old big bite here shortly. I like the water movement in here. Yeah, it's just enough. Uh, well, last night it rained probably three inches. It didn't muddy up our water, but uh, it's a lot cooler this morning than it was yesterday, so I'm sure it's got him a little lock jaw. Yesterday we come in here and we got five bites in 15 minutes. Today we've been fishing for 15, we ain't had but one, so. Definitely slowed them down, but they ain't going anywhere. They're in here. Back on Jake Lee and Jacob Fouts. Throwing swim jigs in shallow cover is paying off. That one might be a keeper. I don't think it will be that. Second one of the day. Uh, we're still catching them on a swim jig here. Moving baits, pretty much predominantly what we've caught them on. But we, we, we have caught a couple big ones slowing down, flipping a tube, a jig, something like that. Later in the day, we're probably gonna have to slow down. Checking back with Nathan Martin and go, Parker Davis. They've got a hook in fish number one. Golly. Uh, oh. Not a very big one, but we'll take it. Back us all. I got it, I got it, I got it. That's the male. Good job. That right there will get your blood pumping. Oh, yeah. When you know you got five pounders down there, you don't know which one's biting, you can't see them. Moving on, we'll check in with Missouri State's Nick King and Hayden <laughs> Lee. Hey, there's a, there's a mom. Yeah. There's another one in there somewhere. Yeah, there's another one in there. There, there is. she is. <laughs> Scared the crap out of me. Well, midday update here. And as you can tell, the wind is howling. We fished through about every condition we can this morning. Uh, I was really hoping that the sun would stay out, but it's it's pretty spotty right now. And we, we've even been rained on a little bit. I think a lot of the bags are gonna be a lot lower than what people thought um, with these conditions. And given the amount of pressure on the lake. We got we got over three or 400 boats out on the lake today. So, I mean, the lake's really fishing small. Uh, I think the guys that are gonna come out on top today are gonna find their own water, something that no one else has found and stick with it. But for the majority of the guys, uh, sharing water is gonna hurt. And we've had to deal with some of that today as well. And and not only that, but the weather is playing against us, not in our favor. But I think total to take the tournament, you're gonna to need a little over 40 pounds. And for big bass, I think anywhere between seven and eight pounds would be a reasonable guess. So we'll see. I mean, I could be, I could be completely wrong. I don't know, it's gonna be an interesting afternoon. I really hope since we don't have to weigh in until four o'clock, we can get on a, maybe a three to four o'clock bite. And that's kind of what I'm banking on right now to fill this limit out. So we'll have to see. Just keep our heads down, keep grinding. It's setting up to be a tough day on Dardanelle, but conditions do apply to all anglers. Mother Nature does not discriminate. <laughs> 